done a fair bit in iMovie, but now I'm graduating on to Final Cut, I've heard it's miles better. So, yeah, I'm just going to give it a go. Yes. Trying to eat a little bit more healthier. Healthier? Is that a word? Trying to eat more healthy. So some spinach, broccoli, asparagus and some tomatoes and then I'm going to put some eggs in there and make a bit of a hash. Me and my girlfriend often have conversations about if foods are girl foods or boy foods. So she thinks a steak is a man food. And there you have it. It doesn't look very nice but there's four of my five a day there so not bad. My diet's been shocking recently and I've been feeling really really tired so I need to change things and try and get that back on track. Just want to have a discussion about girl and boy foods. Why? Because I'm eating my breakfast. I know. That breakfast I made you, what's it like on a scale one to ten? It's incredibly healthy. Sorry, camera shake. What? It's alright, carry on. Oh, now the dog's coming in. Can I just not have some fucking peace in the morning? So, girl and boy food, is a steak and uh, boy food or girl food? Yeah, steak's like boy food. What about uh, a... girls can eat it too. It's not about being sexist, it's just that some things feel more like masculine and some things feel more feminine. So, what about a sausage? <laughs> boy food? Yeah, but is it? Because <coughs> women like sausage, so... Oh, shut up. Plenty of boys I know like sausage too. Oh, so it's a man food, those sausages. I don't know. It's a weird one. Like candy floss, girl food. Is it? I don't know. Is it? What about a... What other object? Uh, food. Food? What about a piece of lettuce? It's not even food, is it? What is it then? It's just a non-entity. What about a... aubergine or eggplant? Why? Why are you having this conversation with me? I don't know, it's just a random conversation, isn't it? So, so, okay. So, look look at my face. Does it look that interested in your random conversation right now? Mm, not really. No. I'm tired. I know. Well, I stink. I need a shower. You've just pushed a plate of breakfast in front of me, which is delightful, so I'm eating my food. Mm hmm and I've got, I'm on a time thing. What about a strawberry? Just oh, seriously. A strawberry, tell Fucking me. Fucking girl food. Is it? Yes. What about a piece of quiche? Girl food. What about a... Rob, I need to eat my breakfast. Okay, last one. What about a samosa? Now that's a hard one, isn't it? Mm. A vegetarian samosa or a meat samosa? Hmm. So I'd say a meat, meaty one. Yeah. It's probably a boy food. Okay. A little chopped vegetable one. Maybe a girl food. I so, so is a, so is a vindaloo a man oh, food? Be careful, Rob. We'll get accused of everyday fucking sexism or something by talking about girl foods and boy foods. Oh, best end it there then. Yeah. Let's continue our day. <laughs> Busy watching a final cut tutorial, so. I'm doing it properly, I'm learning from the masters on YouTube. <laughs> so I've just imported some castle footage from Scotland last week and I'm going to do a bit of an edit, so watch this space. So I'm going to post it on the YouTube channel as a separate video, hopefully. Trying to clean up the video. It's, uh, it's not looking great at times, so I'm looking at colour correction. It's a bit challenging. I think what I did whilst I was at this castle was that I was far too overexposed and I didn't use filters, which is pretty annoying. So I'm going to see if I can tidy it up a little bit. Um, still very new to this, so I haven't really got a clue what I'm doing with this right now, but I'm going to do some studying and see what I can do to balance the colours out far more. So this clip doesn't look too bad at the minute, but... I don't know, it's just a little bit misty at the minute, so... I've just sort the horses out. It's raining and I'm going to get wet. Got the hay for you, mate. 
What I've realised is that there's so much to learn with the video editing stuff. So I've spent a little bit of time today looking at Final Cut Pro and there's so much to it. So I'm going to learn bit by bit and I don't profess to be an absolute wizard editing. I've used iMovie a little bit but Final Cut I think is the next level so I'm going to do my best to learn as much as I can. You happy mate? You happy you got food Leo? I thought that my drone video was filmed in the wrong way. It was all cloudy and everything and I was thinking shit this footage which I've taken is awful. So I spoke to a friend of mine in Chicago or Illinois, around that kind of area, and basically gave him a call. Well, he called me on Facebook Messenger and went through a few things. And apparently, I didn't optimize the settings to see the video in its truest, highest definition, so to speak. So, what setting I had on in Final Cut was kind of like a scaled down version. So what I did was I exported some video onto my desktop and then looked at it in quick time and in quick time it looked absolutely fine. So I couldn't understand what the problem was so we went through it and it's now sorted. So I'm just working on a little YouTube video of a castle in the Scottish Highlands. So I'll be posting that within the next day or two I think. So at the minute I'm really really busy trying to learn the editing and it's kind of like a catch-22 situation where I'm trying to think about doing these vlogs and trying to come up with like cool stuff to include in them but I need to learn how to edit so the vlogs look good. Obviously the story is the main element of the vlogs but it's quite tough at the minute so even now, I haven't particularly framed this shot right, the light's awful, but you know what, I'm learning and that's the most important thing. So, yeah, bear with me and thanks everyone for watching. By the way, if you want to have a look at my drone photography, have a look on Instagram at Shoesmith Drones, which is the same as the name of this channel. And the sun decides to come out right behind me and the video probably looks awful, but you know what, so what, I'm learning. See you in the next one. Oh, and remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Bye-bye.